Hi there, I'm Ben. Now today I'm going to show you how to assemble your metal grid futon frame to your wooden arms. Now these two will come together in the same box. Uh, if for some reason they are not in the same box and you only get one or the other, make sure you have both parts before you start. Now this is what's going to come with the box that you order. You're going to have two arms here. These are Burpor medium oaks. Yours may look different, but this is what we're going to use for the example today. Comes with a right arm and a left arm. Now this is your grid here. Once you take it out of the box, there's going to be a hardware pack and also the two seat and back frames here along with four stretch rails. Now I'm just going to go through the instructions here. As you can see, they're listed by letter of the part and also quantity here. Picture of a diagram is going to be on the right hand side of the front page of your instructions. We start with letter A. Letter A is your left hinge here. Letter B is your right hinge. C is your seat section. D is your back section. Letter E is your stretcher rails. There should be four of these black metal stretcher rails. It's going to come with four medium bolts, which is right here. This is your one inch letter F part. Then it's going to come with 12 longer bolts, which is your part letter G. Then it's going to come with 20 washers, silver washers, that's letter H. Letter I is a large nut, that's going to come with 12 of those, there's going to be a dozen of those. J is your Allen wrench, it's going to come with one Allen wrench and one open end wrench. Letter L is going to be your hook, this is what connects the back and the seat of your fruit tongue together. Letter M is going to be four rubber pads here, this is uh, for protection on the seat portion of your futon against the, the, the rails there. Letter N is a black lock washer right here. There's going to be a dozen of these. Letter O is your mattress retainer right here. This is what keeps the, the mattress on the seat of the futon without sliding off. Letter P is your T legs right here. This is what supports the futon and attaches to the stretcher rails. Letter Q is going to be your cotter pin. Now this is a small little pin. Make sure you don't lose this. Make sure you uh, keep this in a safe spot with all your other parts. Letter R is your longest bolts here. These are three and a three and a half inch. Excuse me. There's eight of these. This is what's going to attach your arms to your rails. And then there's going to be six of these shortest bolts here. That's letter S. Then there's going to be four small nuts, four small lock washers, and four small regular silver washers. With that, that concludes all the parts that come with your, with your bed. And uh, next video, we're going to show you how to get started.